I'm going to give you some tips on playing chords. Uh, with When you're doing a boogie woogie type pattern, you use a rocking motion in your right hand. When you play chords, you move up and down evenly at your elbow, not, not in your wrist. Yeah. The key is when you're playing a solid chord to make your hand like a statue of sorts and then just drop the whole hand down. So if this is a chord you're going to play, you know, put your fingers where they need to be and make a statue and drop the whole hand. And then you can move around without really thinking. It's just, it's all an elbow precision, not trying to play each individual note, but grouping them together. And the same thing would be for octaves. So practice octaves. That is one exercise you can do. Throw a little bit of, I mean, without the pedal, it doesn't sound as exciting. I made it sound exciting with the pedal. It's, all kinds of little tricks you can do. Uh, for instance, Boogie Woogie would be a rocking motion. Essentially, you'd be playing these notes like that repeatedly, only rocking for each one. And you can go into other notes. And, and, and a variant on this this. And that would be C, do the same thing in F. And then there's other things you can do like this, watch carefully. some wrong notes in there. Um, that's the key though when playing things. So for instance, if you were playing uh, Viva La Vida, you want to keep your hands like statues. Um, and there's... case you're compartmentalizing your hand and this would be all in the joint but the drop would be with when this note plays so as such so there will be times to use individual fingers but make statues and drop them as you can that's an important technique no.